Hey guys, welcome back to another morning in Havelock. So, today's uh, video is, uh, I'm sure you've seen the title already, but we'll just uh, give you a little tour of uh, where we're staying. So last uh, evening we checked into this place called Green Valley Resort. Um, it's uh, on Vijayanagar Beach, uh, so it's about 4 kilometers from the Havelock jetty. And then um, we settled in. Uh, we didn't do much yesterday, we just unpacked. Uh, it's refreshing to unpack and just not have to keep things so ready for you know leaving the very next day. So we did that and um, today we're just gonna uh, you know chill over here. Uh, last night we had dinner at a very local sea pla place. We met another friend, we also chatted up the owner for a little while learning about the place. Actually sorry not the owner, the manager of this property and then uh, made a few friends while sitting at the dining uh, cafeteria area and all of that so um, i'm just still getting used to the new gimbal so please forgive me if <laughs> i don't point it in the right direction so the the room we're staying so as you can see there are a lot of cottages here uh, we're staying in this one here uh, shishira is going to give us a room tour in a bit uh, and she'll also tell us how much this particular room is costing us for the night so i'll show you around uh, but essentially this um, you know this entire property is in the middle of what looks like a coconut grove and uh, not sure what these other trees are but uh, it's it's really nice it looks really pretty and um, we really like the place especially in the monsoon so it's all very uh, green very lush um, the skies are gray it's not too sunny um, the rain is quite bad but you get pockets of uh, dryness in the morning so you can still venture out and stuff Anyways, we'll show you more of the island, so we'll talk about the weather then. But for now, let's go check out the room and see whether it's worth what we're paying for each night. So we walk this way into our path, into our own private little section. And this is what the cabin looks like. So as you can see, there's a bunch of windows there. And then right here's the entrance. I've kept a little bucket outside in case you want to wash your feet and I'm just hello. gonna enter in hello resident human hello this is our little bed and the best part of the room is the bed has a beautiful view just look at this wow and we have windows this side too so we have a um, just to show you what the view looks like. It's a little foggy in here because of the humidity, but yeah, you can imagine. And over here, we have our washroom. We have this little area, we have a little small sink and a stand where we can keep our stuff and even a soap stand. So this is like kind of nice for a good makeup spot. We have paid about 3000 rupees for two weeks here. So that literally comes to rupees 200 per night for both of us. So now that you saw the room and uh, yeah so the price is uh, like interesting because uh, all of these huts where you know people are staying they're all uh, mostly rented out by divers so generally uh, you know these are given out at a much better uh, rate but you have to stay for longer than let's say a week so most of these places are at least uh, built for like you know a, a, a family of two and at night it's it's also less uh, uncomfortable the temperature goes down a fair bit uh, it also I think the the amount of rain reduces a little bit so the humidity also drops down slightly uh, yeah so oh, look <laughs> Shishra is there he's uh, just trying to 
put up a story on uh, Instagram. Oh, if you're not following us there, you should uh, you should definitely connect with us there. Uh, we'd love to share more content with you over there. Um, do let me know if you are more curious about uh, where we're staying and uh, anything else. Um, just put up a comment below and then uh, we'll see how we can help you. Sunscreen. Because my mommy will scold. Proof. Audit evidence. <laughs> We got ready, freshened up, and we've just stepped out. We are heading to the market now. Bananas just hanging around on the road. So now we're heading out to the local market. Our plan is to go there and uh, see what we can buy. Maybe some supplies, maybe some snacks, uh, just in case you know we find the restaurants too uh, expensive every day. Um, then we'll also check out what the vegetable market is like and then also ask about the local bus service because uh, tomorrow or day after we plan to go down to the beaches and we want to take the local bus if that's possible. So come let's check it out. We're just walking along the main road and we thought we'll just remind ourselves and also share with you that this is where we stayed the last time we came in 2017. It's a uh, it's, a, it's something like between a three and four star property, also nice rooms and everything. So if you're here, you can check it out. Now I'm wondering should I take this or not. If I take it, it's not gonna be cold forever and it's at least one and a half hours till I can have it. So should I? Should I not? Should I? Should I not? So we just uh, bought some stuff from the supermarket. Bought, uh, got some cup noodles. Got uh, some soap, also got uh, biscuits. So all of this is at MRP pricing. If you go to the smaller shops, uh, there's a little bit of a premium. It's anywhere between 10 to maybe 50% of a premium. But here it's uh, at the MRP itself. So you get you get pretty much everything you get on the mainland. So you can uh, you know easily buy what you need. So this behind me is the vegetable market. Uh, there's also a bunch of other uh, items that you can buy here. There's also a temple here. And then uh, apparently if you come here early in the morning, there's uh, the fresh catch of the day that's sold. So there's this entire vacant plot here. This is where they put up that. And then... The weather is really good today. The sun is out and it's windy and breezy and not much rain till now. It's just drizzling every now and then. It's all good. We are really enjoying the walking around here. It's really very pleasant. Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Hello, buddy. This cafe is so pretty, don't you think so? You mean pretty out of your budget. Found a place for lunch. 
so they have uh, some meals so we'll have the veg thali you see shishira inside she's we can actually come here for breakfast you know there's puri bhaji for 80 bucks and they give four pieces i think it should be sufficient for us there are parathas for 162 pieces the prices look really reasonable so just to fill you in things in havelock aren't very cheap mm -hmm. they're pretty yeah. expensive uh, i mean they the prices are comparable to um, like a semi premium ish place in say bangalore so that's our hometown that's where we are from like just to give an example one cup of coffee back in bangalore we pay 15 rupees but here the same cup of coffee we are paying 60 rupees yeah so it's not very cheap but if you find like the very small uh, tiny places like this one yeah uh, i think the prices are a little better than the others uh, but yeah it's it's up to you if you want the, the fancy meal there are a uh, there are quite a few very good cafes. premium good cafes. Uh, we'll also check out some of that uh, during our time here so we can recommend a couple to you. So here we've ordered uh, the veg chali and uh, we're sitting we... under the fan, we are cooling ourselves <laughs> down and preparing ourselves to nicely the thali. Very very hungry by the way. We just got our food got some rice, we have got two chapatis, we have got some dal, we have got something like a sambarish type but it has vegetables and we have got cluster beans curry as well. Ah, oh, that was a good meal. Yeah, I feel so refreshed. getting better and better. It's cooler now compared to one hour back. Yeah, now it's actually really cold. That's why I think we like visiting places, yeah, places in, the in the monsoon. monsoon. They are the best. Mm -hmm. All the greens come out alive and the weather is so nice and there's no hot sun. That's the best part. Yeah, that's the one thing we really dislike. It's we can deal the with sun. the rain but not the sun. Yeah, but not too much of rain either. Yeah, then but it's we'll also cozy. You can cuddle up and watch the nature. And yeah, so I guess that is, that's why she <laughs> likes the monsoon. <laughs> Anyhow, now we are walking back to the hotel. Uh, once we get there, uh, we'll just show you a little bit more of the place. Uh, then we'll go to the beach, which is right on yeah, the property. The uh, and, and that's part of the Vijayanagar beach. So we'll see what that's like. Uh, apparently, it's best early in the morning we obviously woke up very late today because for the last three nights the we last three been, mornings yeah we have been waking up to alarms which i really do not like so today was the day we woke up on our own we woke up at 3 4 5 am every <laughs> one of the last few days each day a different time so today we woke up at 8 am 8 am or 9 am yeah i mean basically yeah, in I in equivalent time that's like almost like 9 30 or 10 here because you know andaman is like by the hour of the sun we are ahead even though it's on the india time zone so it was almost like waking up very late and you guys might be wondering why i'm so small in the video that's because i'm carrying this heavy bottle sometimes she just behaves like she's from a first world country look Walking, 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 walking all the way. Walking, walking, What else walking. are you thinking? And now you're about to say. I wasn't thinking about anything. And now you're forcing me to say something. And there you go, I just made up two sentences. She has stage fright. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm on the road. Stage fright on the road. Street fight. Fried. Fried. We got some water to drink. Tampo tampo cool cool. To my old job. 
it's been tough. We're now back to our hotel. So we've just crossed over to the the daily rental room section and this is on the side of the beach uh, we are on the other side of the road uh, right there so we cross and there's a little path and what i showed you earlier so we go this way and then you can rent bikes here uh, it's somewhere between 300 and 500 per day depending on how long you're staying but uh, here's the cafeteria you can sit here you can order food they do serve a few dishes um, but then on the other side we can see the beach if you're more than one couple you can always rent out this little villa to yourself you get like two levels and then I, I'm guessing these must be the priciest of the two I see Shishra is calling out to us to come sooner she's just being a little dramatic right now Ah, do you do you see the water there? You can see it there. Okay, we have a runner. It's this so beach. Beautiful. Say that again. It's so beautiful. Wow. It's crystal clear water. Look at the color. The color is just amazing. It's hard to. Uh, believe that this is in India. No, it, what's hard to believe is it's right by, uh, you know, on this property. It's not like a fancy place. It's not like a great, uh, wow. you know, five-star hotel. But you have the same access to the beaches as everybody else does. Okay, I don't think I'm going to her room again. I'm just going to sit here. Yeah, this is awesome. Shishira, huh? what time is it? It's beach o'clock. <laughs> There's a small mangrove forest over here. You can go sit there and then you'll have Shady in front of the water. Uh, we're just going to be spending the rest of the afternoon here before heading back to our room and then calling it a night. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, we'll go somewhere new tomorrow, most likely to uh, Radhanagar beach. So uh, let's see what it looks like. Uh, the weather is quite unpredictable. So we'll only know tomorrow uh, when we get there. And we, we're trying to figure out if we can take the bus like I mentioned earlier. So we're just going to give that a try as well tomorrow. So if you enjoyed watching this video, please leave a comment down below. It really makes a difference. Yes. Um, and if you haven't subscribed already, pretty please subscribe. Bye. Gutsy little buck face. Hey, okay, this is what I was telling. So breezy. Breezy, breezy, breezy. Havelock is breezy. Pudding is looking at me. Bitchy.